What is creativity? Let's say you have two completely unrelated ideas and then you combine them and you synthesize them and you create something new that is greater than the sum of its parts. And I want to show you here a little prototype that I've designed this weekend, which is an example of creativity and synthesization of ideas. So this is basically, it's called, a, it's a racing pool. It's a race car combined with a jacuzzi. So if you're doing some motor racing, you can also have a nice bath in this jacuzzi with you. You've got some bubble jets spraying water in the air here behind the driver. And uh, then you have here at the front, it's like the Rolls Royce spirit of ecstasy. But in this case, it's a golden frog to relate to the bathing and swimming and water combined with this motor vehicle. And uh, it's a high powered V8 with supercharger in the back. You've got some downforce elements to improve cornering speeds and uh, then there's also here we have added a little cookie holder so that you can keep a little cookie here in case you get hungry if you're doing like let's say 24 hour Le Mans or something like that uh, you can replenish your energy and keep racing while taking a bath and uh, this, this is and a good example of, of creativity. I've, I've taken two completely unrelated ideas, motor racing and uh, jacuzzi, and combined them. And this could be something that is greater than the sum of its parts. It could also be a complete disaster because there might be some issues with acceleration and deceleration and also lateral Gs while doing a... Because the water might upset the dynamics of the car and it also might just come out of the pool but that could add a little bit of more tension to the if, if you're doing a competition to see how who could drive the fastest without spilling all the water or flipping the car over because the the center of gravity would be quite high with a really heavy load such as water but anyways you see the, there's there's these, the combination of these two concepts has already generated a lot of other interesting ideas, but, well, I, I suspect that this one might not be the best thing that since sliced bread, but it's an, inter it's an interesting, uh, interesting concept to evaluate still. But basically, this is, this is what cre creativity works like. 99.9% .9 of the time, the ideas that are synthesized turn out to absolutely nothing. It's just garbage, complete disaster. And the final 0.01% is what might save us all and be like the cure for cancer or something like that. But most of the ideas that are created aren't that good, actually. And to be honest, I, I don't really see the future of uh, racing pools but uh, still it makes me makes me a bit happy because I kind of like the thought anyway so I had to realize it and Lego is a perfect tool to, to do such things yeah uh, anyways see you later